Welcome back. Imagine being able to disinfect everyday items just by waving a wand. No more wipes or chemical sprays. Consumer investigator Danielle Serino found two products that claim to do just that. She's tested out some bacteria busters, and Danielle, I understand you brought in some scientists for this. Oh, we did. Two specialists from the VA here in Cleveland. Now, a recent study found that commercial-grade handheld UV lights can kill several types of bacteria, but is that true for the ones consumers can buy? We tested some germy surfaces to see whether you're worth your money. Germs and bacteria like these are just about everywhere, from toys and technology. Even the soles of our shoes can get us sick, since some of us put them where we shouldn't. Viruses and other bacteria can survive on these surfaces for hours, or some, some bacteria even longer than that, weeks or months. Which means touch it and you could be in trouble. <laughs> so we brought in specialists from the VA Medical Center in Cleveland to test out two handheld sanitizers, the Germ Reaper and the Germ Eyes, which both use UV lights to sanitize and sterilize. So we'll start with the shoe. Our scientists swab several products, including my cell phone, some sticky icky toys from a colleague's son, and a communal keyboard in our newsroom, which she put into a petri dish to get a baseline level of germs, before trying to blast them away with the wands. And when she was done, she swiped everything again. So we'll take these back to the lab, we'll incubate them in our 37 degree incubator. Three days after our unscientific germ study, for demonstration purposes, I think what this nicely shows is that these devices are really not great. There were fewer germs on the sneakers, but not anywhere near the 99.9% .9 promised for either product. We would almost expect it to eliminate all the bacteria that's there, but there's still some that's remaining. It was the same thing with my cell phone. And for the toys, no playing around here. As you can see, it's kind of gross and disgusting. Only the keyboard showed a significant reduction of germs because there's so many nooks and crannies, it's hard for us when we use a wipe to get in there and clean. That's one place where UVC is really an advantage. And why the VA uses it for their keyboards. But get this, the doctor says safety issues with these online products outweigh worries over germs. I feel safer just using a disinfectant wipe uh, than I would using this type of device that, that uh, potentially you can be exposed to UV in, with your eyes or your skin. Now, we tried to contact the makers of the Germ Reaper and Germ Eyes, but weren't successful. And FYI, in 2015, the FTC settled with two companies that sold handheld UV lights for more than half a million dollars, alleging they didn't have solid scientific backing for their claims. Nonetheless, I put links to the products in my story on our website, WKYC.com. A lot of creepy stuff out there, it looks mm. like, right? Yeah, a lot of dirty germs. I thought there would be a lot more on the phone, because mm -hmm. that's right. kind yeah, of the common perception, right. but... No, and it's also your own germs, you know, not strangers on the keyboards, but the keyboards <laughs> are... Mm. Back to the wipes. It. Yeah. Thanks, Danielle. Thanks, Danielle. Right, thank you.